So I didn't want to be where I went necessarily because of that, but I also had like a inkling, like I just kind of felt like that. I really liked it when I was looking things up online and looking at all their resources and specifically talking to Suzanne Ostersmith, not Susanna, Suzanne Ostersmith, um, who happens to be the spitting image of me, uh, 60 years of age and the director of the department. So I was just like, wait, this is weird. Um, and so I was talking to her and I got really excited because I was like, I'm coming on campus. Can I get into a class? And she was like, yes, please come to this jazz class at this time. Um, and her excitement for her, the program instilled in me the excitement for the program that I still have today for the dance program specifically, but she was just so excited and ready for anyone, me. She's like, you need to come here. You know, she's very individual. And she, I could tell that she cared about each student that came into the school. Um, and so that inspired me to kind of lean towards Gonzaga, even though I was visiting other schools. I had this bias in the back of my brain. But um, I, too, am spiritual, as, as Dylan shared. And I just was like, God... I'm so stupid. Please just make it so obvious because I don't listen. The Lord just really punched me in the face and was like, uh, this is home. And I actually just started crying, like actually just bawling in the middle of St. Al's. I'm supposed to be quiet um, because they're like doing prayer. Um, but it's a gorgeous church. Um, even if you're not spiritual, you should see it. Um, but I was in the middle and I was like embarrassed. I was the only one on the tour. So of course, like, it's just me, Aaron, this lady that I got to know really well and my mom. And she's like, are you okay? Like you need to go. And I was like, no, like this is, I'm, I'm home. Like I belong here. And to this day, I belong here. I'm working here now and I never want to leave.